Hi friends, in this video, I'm going to share with you another amazing feature of ChatGPT4. This feature is exclusively available for the Plus subscribers and it's an amazing feature for those who try to use ChatGPT4 on a daily basis. Now you might be wondering that once you start giving ChatGPT some prompts, after a while ChatGPT kind of loses the context of the conversation and starts giving irrelevant responses. To get over with this problem, OpenAI came up with the solution of updating ChatGPT4's memory. So let me show you how this works. Let's suppose if I'm a person and I want to learn about how to repair my car, say for example, I need to understand the importance of getting my tires aligned. So what I need to do is I need to develop a persona and I need to use ChatGPT for that. Let me show you how. So that's a pretty generic prompt, but it can serve as a very good starting point. Hi, Chad, can you please develop a detailed persona of an auto mechanic with experience in wheel alignment and balancing? So right now it has automatically updated its memory. It knows that I'm going to ask different questions related to that. So it came up with the person profile of James Martinez He's 34 years old and he lives in San Diego, California. He has an associate degree in automotive technology from Technical Institute and all of that stuff. So we'll say, please take this role and update in your memory. Now that's the most important part. Now we'll see the magic. It says memory updated. And if you want to see what's available in chat GPT's memory, if there's anything you want to select out of this memory that chat GPT got, what I want you to do is click on your user profile, go to customize chat GPT. Sorry. You need to go over there in settings and you need to click personalization. Here you're going to find different, all the different sorts of memories that I have used and you can use them to your liking. So James Martinez is over here. These are all the things that exist in ChatGPT memory and we can click on the role we want ChatGPT to take and there we go. So now ChatGPT is going to act like James Martinez, regardless of the fact if you ask questions today, a week later, a month later, or even a year later. Don't you think that's interesting? So let me ask something related to car alignment. We'll say, hi, James. Why does So that's a pretty generic question you can ask a mechanic. Hi, James. Why does my car with no alignment done for five years wobbles at 100 kilometers per hour? So James will give us the answer. If your car hasn't had alignment in five years, start to wobble at higher speeds like 100, there are a few potential issues that could be causing this. So all of those things, tire, con tire conditions, suspension components, all of that stuff. Now, if I want to learn about something like camber, I say, hi, can you please explain me the Can you please explain me the role of camber in easiest way possible? 
It's the angle of the wheels in relation to the ground. When you look at them from the front or back of the car, imagine if the top of the wheel leans out from the center of the car, that's called a positive camber. If it leans towards the car, that's a negative camber. Here's why camber is important. And it gives you all the details about that. So that's it for today. That was a starter about the memory feature of ChatGPT4. What I want you guys to do is to subscribe to this channel to learn more about the amazing features of ChatGPT. And last but not the least, don't try to experiment with this amazing feature and let me know in the comment section what sort of responses you got. Up until the next video.